Hey, 5th Jack 05 of you here. Today I'm going to teach you how to perform a trick where the spectator cuts to a four of a kind. Alright, here's a performance for this trick. Before I start, I have already made a prediction right here, and I'll place it on the table right there. And I would ask the spectator to divide the cards or cut the cards into three roughly equal piles. So in this case, I would cut like that. I would place one here, place another one here, and place the third pile right so. And then I would flip each card, the top card like so. In this case, it's the five, the ten, and the ace. So basically, here's the rule. You're going to take a pile and place whatever the number this uh, uh, this number, the number it is on the card. So in this case, it would be the ace, like so. And place a card on each other piles, like so. And uh, drop the pile remaining on the uh, original spot. Again, for this pile, it would be 10 cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and place one card each on different piles, and do the same thing with the last one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, because it's 5 of clubs, place one card each on other piles. So basically, oops, sorry about that. Um, by doing so, what you just have done is that, um, without knowing, you just helped me cut two of four, four of a kind. See how you just cut into three kings, and then here's my prediction. The king of diamonds and that is a performance guys here's how i did it all right so this is an easy impromptu uh magic trick that requires a little bit of a setup so what you need to do is you need to have a four of a kind in my performance i picked the four kings and uh you have to pick out the five and three random cards one two three like so and this is a setup you're going to place uh, three random card. I mean, the three kings. First, three random cards, and then the five. So what right now would look like this: the five, one, two, three random cards, the king, the king, the king, and this is going to be your prediction card, and you're going to place that somewhere in the middle of the deck, and then the when the performance starts, what you're going to say, you're going to say is. Um, I'm going to make a prediction before the card trick even starts. And then you're going to go ahead like this. And then without showing, you're going to pick out, locate, and pick out the king of clubs and place it on the table. Okay? And then what you could do is you could just give it a false shuffle or any false uh, cuts or anything like that. And then you're going to give the deck to spectator and then show them that you're going, uh, you're going to tell them to cut the deck into three piles or some three equally piles. Right, and you're going to do the same thing, like that, like that, like that. So what you have just done is that you have cut the deck into three equal piles, in which this is the five. See, five of diamonds. So, and it's a really self easy, self working trick. So from now on, what you do is you flip the very top card, like so. In this case, we got really unlucky. We got high cards queen which would be 12 so you would tell the spectator to deal 12 cards because queen represents 12 onto the table so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and deal one card to each other pile like so and place the remaining cards at, on the original position right and then he will he or she will do the same for this one so 12 cards here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and deal one card here and another one here and do the same thing with the very last pile one two three four five because it's five of diamonds deal one card here and right here and what you have just done is that there's no slides involved because it's a mathematical self-working card trick and you've just cut two a four of a kind and then basically the whole effect is that before you begin you're going to be like um I'm, you're going to help me uh, uh, cut into four of a kind and then you do the whole effect and in theory if you did the setup correctly and everything correctly you'll be perfectly fine one thing to make sure one thing you have to remember is that you always do 
the one with the, uh, the pile that has the five of diamonds last because before you do this, this is going to be what you're going to be in. So you're going to have uh, one, two, three, four, five. It's going to be like this. So you basically go one, two, three, four, five, right? And then basically you're going to have three kings right after. So you're going to deal one king here, one king here. And that makes it seem like the spectator cut into a four of a kind. And just remember, you can use any cards or any four of a kind you want, and you can still achieve the same effect. So here's that's the tutorial, guys. I hope you liked it. I'll see you next time.